Rangers, our state champions. Forest Hills set your Wednesday. Due to the coronavirus, all 2020 spring sports have been canceled, and it's been pretty hard on all spring athletes, especially for those seniors out there. So we asked some of them to send in their thoughts and opinions on how they're dealing with this. I think one of the ways that I'm coping with the spring sports being canceled is keeping myself busy by doing my schoolwork, hanging out with my family. I'm just trying to keep myself busy and not really think about it. Personally, as a senior, it was pretty hard to cope with the fact that spring sports are canceled. This coronavirus is definitely affecting my everyday life. I mean, I can't hang out with my friends, can't go to school, can't play the sport that I love to do, so that's really hard. I feel like it's more of just like a big chapter in my life that's missing. Yes, this is affecting my daily life pretty bad. Um, I wanna be at school and playing lacrosse with my best buds. Well, as an athlete, I'm used to working out every day, and now it takes a lot of self-motivation to stay working out every day. I think one thing that I miss about the season the most is the close group of friends that you make during the season. And this is for any sport. When you're playing on a team, you get so close to the people and it's like a family, which is like one of the good things about being on a team sport. I miss in my last season because this is like my last season ever playing high school lacrosse. It really does suck because I grew up with these kids playing my whole life with these all these guys. So it does suck definitely, but I can't change that again. So just gotta move on. Um, look at forward to the future. One thing I'm definitely missing about track and running is the feeling of accomplishment after like a big race and just getting to spend time with those teammates for one last season. And what was the last season? And Bella and I were captains, so we were really excited to be captains and to play our last season. And it was the first time that girls lacrosse was split, so it was brand new and it was really interesting, the dynamic of what was gonna happen. I'm running a lot at home to keep myself in shape. Doing wall ball for lacrosse. At home, I've been like keeping myself in shape by running. Um, playing lacrosse outside, lifting, so all three of those things I've been doing pretty well. I've been running and I actually have been to the track and the field a few times just because not ready to let it go yet. I guess something that comes good out of this cancellation is people aren't getting sick. That's one of the main reasons why they canceled it. So I think there is some good and they did this for a good purpose. I really wish that this season we could have this season honestly, but I think that Really, the only good thing that is coming out of canceling this season is um, keeping people safe, so. This whole cancellation has taught everyone to really put your best effort for anything that you do at any time and really appreciate every single moment. I'm looking forward to going to college in my future and hopefully playing club sports. In the future, I'm looking forward to playing, obviously, more lacrosse. The uh, lacrosse has been a part of my life for as long as I can remember. Personally, I think next year will go a lot smoother because hopefully this coronavirus will not be present in our lives. I think next year will be obviously pretty weird for both the coaches and athletes to try and make up that lost time of an entire season. I also believe that they'll overcome that obstacle really easily. I think next year will go pretty good. I'm just ready to work, um, ready to grind out all the work that comes into playing at the next level. Some positive advice for others that are going through this situation. One thing is look on the bright side of things. I think it's better to have us all be safe than for this virus to be going around. Try something new that you've never had the time to do before. My advice to all the spring athletes out there would just be to stay motivated, stay active at home, and to stay positive with your thoughts because it'll get better. And that even though this was our last season, as seniors, there's a bright side to everything. Seniors, uh, yeah, we can't play our season, but on a class, we never take any moment for granted because you never know what could happen. So I just wanted to like say thank you to FHC and any kids who's going out there, just think positive, stay positive, and yeah, go Rangers.